Hello folks, welcome back. So in this tutorial, I'll show you what is the purpose of this DP. That is called as, if you if you look at our code, you will see, you'll notice that we're using 200 DPs and 150 DP. And if you change this, uh, you're going to see the changes reflecting on the screen. The width is going to change. So what does this DP stands for? So the DP stands for, is called Density Independent Pixels. That is called as the Density Independent Pixels. Now it is like a um, it is like a unit of measure, just like we have meters and centimeters. Similarly, we have something called as the DPs to measure the images. So, for example, now if I say two pixels by pixels, if instead of using um, a two DPs, if I say two pixels, now what's going to happen is in a lower resolution device, what's going to happen is this whole thing will be used so the the image will look like 2 dp uh, 2 pixels is going to be it's going to block this one similarly if you say on the in the other middle resolution device it will take this amount of space and in the case of the uh, high resolution device it will just take a very small 2 dp space so pixels so because it's taking 2 pixels in each of these devices so we don't want this to happen we don't want that in a high resolution device our image should look that small or in medium it should look this small and in lower it's fine because we said two pixels by two pixels here so so we don't want like this we wanted that no matter what kind of image that we have I wanted to make sure that uh, my image looks in it looks reasonably okay size in all these different resolutions so then we come up with something called as the DPs, which is called as the density independent pixels. Now, what do you mean by this? So density independent pixels means that it will, since it has 2 DP by 2 DP, that's what we're going to say. Uh, let's say we say it as, here we say it as 2 DP by 2 DP, means 2 DP in length and the width. So what's going to happen is it's going to take half of this. So this portion is going to will have the image will cover this one, the whole area. Here it's going to take half half of this. So which is going to be around, I think, this particular. This is how the image is going to be looking. So let's say this is of uh, eight dips down. So we're going to use two half of this. So we're going to say this is going to be half of it. Similarly, in 2 DPs, the 2 DP by 2 DP is again going to take this 2 DP. So in, no matter what is the image um, as, as uh, image size in the all these different devices, it's going to take a, a reasonable amount of 2 DP. So it's going to be half of this, you can think. Okay, so this is half of this, the whole thing. Generally, it's going to be half. If you do it by pixels, only this is this is going to be with the pixels. Only if you say two pixels, only this portion will be will be used. Only this one, and here it's going to be very really small. Okay, so this is that's why we prefer to do by two uh, dips because no matter what kind of resolution device it, it's going to look at it. The image is going to look reasonably okay in all the different kinds of devices. So that's why we call it as two DP density independent pixels.